Good evening, everyone. I'm Chris Gutierrez. And I'm Lauren Freeman. Parents in SciFair ISD are hoping to get a look at the new COVID protocols at any moment. The district's expected to release them by the end of the day. Our Jacob Rascone is live tonight with what we know so far. Jacob? Yeah, a lot of eager parents here and throughout the region as some of the districts say they are planning to update their COVID protocols based in part on the new TA guidelines and on some of what some of the other districts are doing. So far, though, tonight, even though SciFair said they would have it by the end of business, we have not seen that. A lot of parents are looking for it. So right now we talked to some of parents who are eager for virtual learning. That's something that is not offered here, not offered anywhere that we've checked so far we've checked about 10 districts in the last week so far nobody's offering virtual learning saying that the state has not provided funding so we are waiting to hear whether or not cypher is going to change its mind a little on that so the parent that we talked to tonight started a change.org petition to bring back some virtual learning limited just for people like her who truly do not want to send her uh, children she has four children uh, one of them going into fourth grade another into pre-k does not want to send them she went out and knocked doors recently to try to get others to sign the petition and here's the reaction she got I have mixed reactions. I have people who are, who are very supportive, who are along the same pages, along the same lines as me, who really want virtual learning again to be an option this year because they have immunocompromised kids at home. They don't want exposure or whatever reasons. And then I have families who are fed up, <laughs> who are frustrated because they don't want mask mandates. They, they, they think everyone's going to be fine and it's going to be okay. So here is that change.org petition has uh, almost 500 signatures so far. So just to recap of all of the districts we've been to uh, 10 or 11 so far, uh, no mask mandates, of course, per, per the governor's order besides HISD considering it. No social distancing at everyone except Fort Bend ISD, no screening and no virtual learning. So we are waiting to see if any of that will change. We uh, we will keep looking and checking and bring you the latest on air and online reporting here live in Cyprus. I'm Jacob Rascone. Guys, back to you.